It's a sunny morning at Barcelona Airport in Spain. After start checklist, anti ice. Anti ice off. Rudder trim. Rudder trim is zero. The crew of German Wings Flight 9525 is preparing for departure. Flight attendants, please take your seats for takeoff. Captain Patrick Sondenheimer is a former Lufthansa first officer who recently transferred to German Wings. First Officer Andreas Lubitz, who has been with the airline for just over a year, will handle the flying. Cleared for takeoff, 07 right. German Wings 9525. Take off thrust. Just after 10 a.m., German Wings Flight 9525 gets airborne. They're heading northeast over the Gulf of Lyon towards the French Alps. They should be in Dusseldorf in just over two hours. 27 minutes into the flight, the plane reaches its cruising altitude of 38,000 feet. Marseille, German Wings 9525. Flight level 380. Air traffic control in Marseille tracks the plane as it crosses France. Four minutes later, the controller in Marseille notices something odd. German Wings Marseille, confirm what cruising altitude you're cleared for. Flight 9525 is descending without permission. German Wings, this is Marseille. Come in, please. We've got a problem here. German Wings are unresponsive, descending rapidly. The plane is dropping steadily. In just minutes, it's lost 10,000 feet. The control center is now on emergency mode. Now approaching 25,000 feet. The Airbus is hurtling downwards at maximum operating speed, an astonishing 350 knots. German wing, come in. Lima, Echo, X-ray, relay from Marseille. I need you to try and contact German wings 9525. What is their situation? The plane has dropped below 7,000 feet. The towering mountains loom closer. It's been 10 minutes with no radio contact, an eternity for controllers. Oh, up. Too low. Terrain. We've lost contact. The plane is now too low to be detected by radar. Oh, up. 